Okay, so I can't stand out in the hallway to show you the door because it's nighttime and Italy is really strict about their laws on quietness at night, so I didn't want to stand out there. But this is our door. It doesn't really look like a door, it looks like a jail cell. But you open the door. There's the hallway. And then like we have this little entry hall thing. And this is Danielle and I's room. So this is my side. That's her side. And this is the street, Via de Servi. Down there. It's pretty quiet out there now, but... Still hear some chatter from the restaurant right below us. And then... This is our living room. We have a futon and a little couch and a TV that we don't know how to work. <laughs> we can turn it on, but there's no cable. And then these are all of our shoes. And then this is our bathroom with the washing machine. Oh, there goes the fan. Yeah, it's pretty nice size. Really small, but pretty good. And then the cool thing about it is if you close the door, ooh, all you get is a wall full of mirrors. So that's kind of cool. And then this is our kitchen with a gas stove and an oven and dishwasher, fridge, normal kitchen stuff. And then out there it's basically just a big open space with scaffolding. Um, we don't really know what it's there for, but it's there, so. And it may look like we have air conditioning, but they must have turned it off because it hasn't been working. So we're a little salty about that, no worries. And then down this hallway, there's no light, but we have Emily's room and then we have our drying rack. You have to hang your clothes in Italy, so. It's not that big, but it's cozy and cute, and three of us fit in here nicely. So, there's our apartment.
see what's on your mind We got other things that we could do with our time We could rule the world No, you say you never need another girl But you're not making sense Trying to keep it moving while you're on the fence Without at least sticking her tongue out. Turn the lights off, carry me home.